Good morning, everyone. Today is a new day. It's a new week already. I want to make the banana bread today because these bananas, they're going to go bad and they're going to go bad quick. Well, they're already really bad, but I need to buy flour. I have almond flour. Wait, I think I have flour. Oh no, that's rice. I mean, <laughs> that's sugar. This is all I have for cooking. And then like two bags of rice. I don't know what else goes in banana bread. It's been a while since I've made it. So this is my little fit for today. Just like a cute little gray sweater, like some black pants and then like some comfy vans. I've been wearing a lot of sweaters recently or not sweaters, like hoodies and like, like long sleeve stuff just because it gets really, really cold. Um, there's another dilemma that I need to discuss about. So this is a big situation. Like all of this, I need to go through every single piece of clothing there's like a lot more, you just can't see it because of how dark it is over there. But I need to like really, really, really like go through this closet, take out all this stuff that like I don't use. Like there's a lot of things in here I'm noticing. Like a lot of tags are popping out and it's like if I never wore it, I'm not gonna wear it. And I usually have my closet like color coded, but oh my God, we got the blacks with the oranges, the reds with the blues. I need to figure out a situation for that and then make it look cute. I'm gonna go to the store and I'm gonna go buy the flower. Also, I wanted to show you guys this water bottle that I purchased. It's my little Brita bottle, but it's so useful. I save myself so much time from like dishes and like having to like clean stuff just because you literally fill this up and you carry it with you. And I'm literally like, I take this everywhere I go now. I don't know how filtered the water is because because it's kind of hard to believe that it gets filtered right away when you drink it. It doesn't work like the jar thing or like the big one because the big one you pour the water and it like drips down, filters it. This one, as you're drinking it through the straw, it has a little straw. Oh my God, the straw is so dirty. As you drink it, it filters. But I don't know, I like it. It might be gimmicky. Okay, so I just got back home. I went to Target and I, oh, I purchased a few things. Let me show you guys what I got at Target. I got eggs, because I don't know if the eggs that I have in the fridge are good. So I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna buy them now before I get home and like they're, they're bad. I got carrots and broccoli. This is not for the banana bread. <laughs> I am not making banana bread with broccoli. I could put carrots. That's too much, too much. We need to stick to the recipe. This is for, for chicken. So I'm gonna make like a little chicken stir fry with um, this stuff for tonight. I got the flour and then I got chocolate chips. So I might put some chocolate chips in there. And then on the way to pay, I walked by the toy section. And look what they had. It's kiwi scented slime. And it has the little like, little kiwi. And then it has like these little like ice cubes. I'm gonna open it, we're gonna open it. I'm very curious. Let me put this stuff in the fridge first before I start playing. They had a lot of scents. They had like birthday cake, like cookie dough. I was in between this one or strawberry jam, but this one just looked fun. I can't open it. <gasps> it does not smell like kiwi though. Oh my God. That's fun. Oh my God. No, it was supposed to be like, oh, that was a good one. That was a good one. There's slime everywhere. Oh, okay, a fart. I put up the ring light because I was like, I never use it. Might as well use it. As I was setting it up, I dropped it. <laughs> I dropped it and it went and like all the pieces went everywhere. I'm gonna pull up the recipe for the banana bread. I feel like the ingredients are like so easy. I just can't like think of like, I need something fast, something like easy. So the recipe that I have here says two cups all purpose flour, one teaspoon, baking soda, one teaspoon salt, one cup butter, three cups brown sugar. I don't think I have brown sugar. Two eggs beaten, two thirds cup mashed overripe bananas. So I have four bananas and I'm gonna put all four of them. So if I do the math correctly, I'm gonna go with three eggs. This basically makes 21 servings. Am I gonna sell these? In a large bowl, combine flour and baking soda. Three and a half cups of flour. Okay, so that's about like two cups of flour, so I'm just gonna... I, I'm pulling these out because I do not know what a quarter teaspoon is. So half a tablespoon and one of What? Two-fifths tablespoon salt. Two-fifths teaspoon. How do you measure two-fifths of a teaspoon? What? 
What is one fifth in teaspoon? One fifth equals one fifty three point six teaspoons. I don't have that one. I don't have that one. I didn't buy that one. We don't want it to be too salty. I'm gonna put half a teaspoon, two quarters of a tablespoon. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. <laughs> I literally don't know what I'm saying anymore. Okay, we are definitely making a big mess. I'm gonna put another one of these. Should I put another one? No, because if it comes out salty, we're done. We're not putting any more. In a separate bowl, cream together butter and brown sugar. Stir in eggs and mashed bananas until well blended. Should I put the whole thing? That's a lot of sugar. There is no way. Are you kidding me right now? We're not putting that much sugar. I should have melted the sugar. I mean, the butter. What I want to lick my fingers. <laughs> I literally thought about licking my fingers. Okay, that's what it looks like so far. It literally looks like um, mashed potatoes. Stir banana. Oh, wait, no, we're going too far. Stir in eggs and mashed bananas until well blended. Three and a half eggs. We're doing three eggs. We're doing three eggs. Yo, that's a lot of egg. Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm gonna throw up. Bon Appetit! The bananas look disgusting. Okay, I should preheat the oven to 350 degrees. So this is a pan that I'm gonna use. Hopefully it's big enough. It's the only one we have. Ew, if this falls right now on the table, I'm gonna cry. This is really hard though. I don't think, <laughs> I don't think I was supposed to like stir it. It looks right though. Like it looks like the right consistency. This is what the mixture looks like. Oh my god, it's heavy. It says to butter the, the thing, but I'm not gonna butter it. I'm gonna just like, shh. Oh my god. Oh my god. What is this? Oh my god, there's so much flour, bitch. And then we're gonna add our chocolate chips on the top, like sprinkles. There's so much oil. I put so much oil on this. Okay, I switched to like my like little tripod thing to like show you guys. I want you guys to see the chocolate chip pouring. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. I overdid it on the chocolate chips. But now all we have to do is just stick it in the oven. Should I put it in the top one? Oh my God, it's hot. Top one or bottom one? Top one or bottom one? What do I do? What do I do? We'll go with top. <sighs> okay, she's in there. Hopefully it comes out good. I'm gonna clean this. The table, this, I do not, I don't even know where this came from. I'll come back in 60 minutes and see how it looks. Okay, so the timer just went off. Oh my God. I need to get gloves. <gasps> it smells burnt. Oh my God, I have the glove on backwards. Oh my God, it looks good. You guys, this looks really good. The overflow of the chocolate chips. Okay, I'm gonna let it cool down. So I'm gonna give it like 10 minutes and then we'll do like a little taste test and see what it tastes like. Okay, the thing is still really hot. So I, I have these. It looks so good. Should I get a glass of milk? No, no, it's 12 a.m. I do not feel like doing dishes, so I'm gonna use a, <laughs> I'm gonna use a napkin as a plate. Let me show you guys the cutting action. Oh, she's crispy. Why is it so hard? Okay, it's kind of hard, I'm not gonna lie. The consistency, it's giving like, like cookie. This is what it looks like. Oh, it smells really good. It's really dry. Oh my God, it's so dry. This could kill someone. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> it's not good. It's so dry. I don't know if it's because it's still hot. My banana breads never come out like this. This recipe set me for failure. Like I'm still gonna eat it, you know what I mean? Maybe if I like um, dip it in milk. No, we're not drinking milk. You know what the consistency of this reminds me of? Like a dry muffin. You know like those muffins that you get and they're just so dry? I can't even breathe. That's what this reminds me of. Like a dry muffin. It's about to be 12 a.m. And the only reason why I'm awake right now is because I want to watch Harry Styles perform. I hope you guys like this video. If you want to try the recipe at home, don't.
I guess I'll leave it in the bio so you guys can like click it. Maybe it won't come out as dry as mine. But yeah, if you guys want to see some more videos, um, subscribe. It's so, ill. that sounds, I, if you want to see more videos, follow me. That sounds weird too. I don't know. If you like this video and you want to see some more videos, subscribe and have a good night. And I will see you guys soon.